Just had to do a quick video. When I was in high school and I finished my last science fair, I thought this is wonderful. I never have to do it again. Uh, when I finished math, you know, all of those classes you just want to be done with. And I thought I never have to go back. And my children now, they say that to me. I'm never going to use math in my life. Well, guess what happens when you decide to become a parent? That's right, you get to do all of those things all over again. And I got to do science fair again this week with my daughter. And she decided to test music and see what actually helps students improve their learning. But I was told that classical music was so much better for your brain than rock and roll and that they did studies on rats that showed that rats that listened to rock and roll their brains grew all wrong and rats that listened to classical music their brains grew all right and there's a lot of research that has been done. One day after school I was sitting with my sister studying at home and I had the radio going and she looked at me and smugly said you shouldn't be listening to that music it's not good it's not gonna help you study and I thought fine you want me to listen to classical music I got out Aram Kachaturian's saber dance and put that on I was like great let's test your theory snark aside I was really interested at my daughter's experiment because the results were slightly different than I expected them to be she used Handel's water music it was suite number two in D major I expected that to do best because that's what I was always brought up with. And she also used the Wonder Woman theme and she used 9 to 5 by Dolly Parton. So after two different trials and she did 10 students for each trial, Dolly Parton's 9 to 5 beat out the other two songs, which I thought was like seriously hilarious. One of the things that I heard helps you memorize as a consistent tempo and nine to five has an amazing beat it's a great beat i was just you know kind of taken back by the results because i really expected handle and there's not much of a statistical difference and i'm sure that if you went and you did a hundred people and and it was just three minutes per song and they were studying you know certain vocabulary words at any rate uh I was just curious, what do you know about music when you're studying? And what study do you refer to when you say, oh, I have to listen to this when I'm learning a new language or studying math? What do you know about music and how it affects your ability to learn? Comment below. I hope that you have a really great, safe holiday season and best to you. Thanks for watching.